Taco Tuesday. So we're doing these street tacos inspired by the ones that I had when we went to Corpus Christi because those were the best street tacos I've ever had, okay? So first we're gonna start off with this homemade salsa. And I made this in another video, but I'm just gonna show y'all how to do it again, a quicker way, okay? So I have green pepper, tomato, cilantro, lime juice, lemon juice, parsley, and your choice of hot sauce. I just have this one packet today because that's all we need. So I'm just gonna chop all my items up and then I'm gonna show you guys how I prep it before I let it marinate in the refrigerator. Okay, so we have all of our items chopped up. So just add them to your bowl. Okay, once that's done, you have everything in your bowl. I had corn last time, but you can make it however. Parsley, a little bit of lime juice, Lemon, you can use fresh or lemon juice, how I'm using it, and hot sauce. I didn't use a full packet because it's not that much. Salt and pepper. Okay, now it's done so you can let that marinate in the refrigerator for however long or until you're done cooking and that's when we're gonna take it out. Okay, so while the homemade salsa is marinating, we're gonna make this mini margarita. Some have seen this, um, this little concoction I put together, but here's the tutorial for it. This is the only one you will get, okay? So this is the glazed strawberries. They've been glazing for a couple days. I just put a little bit of sugar and lemon juice on them and just throw them in the refrigerator let them do what they do and then i have this frozen fruit punch you can get whatever frozen flavor you want if you want to make it like more of a a pina colada flavor they have one of those too but i like this one and this is the moscato if you can make it if you cannot just make it with fruit and ice there's no problem with that we're not promoting anything over here. We just do what you can do, okay? So we're gonna use one of these, put these to the side. And then I have a little bit of this and I'm gonna put my strawberries in here, just in case I'll have some left over. So we'll get all of this in the blender with ice. Just get to where she needs to be at. And then while that's going, we're gonna get our tacos ready. Okay, so now we're getting ready to do the meat for the tacos. We're just using seasoned steak. It's already pre-seasoned, but fajita steak meat. We're using that and I put my pan on high heat between six and seven. And then I have my mini wrap for the street tacos. And then after we do this meat, this is the key to this. Cook these in the marinade that the meat leaves behind. 
it's gonna get crispy and it's gonna have that buttery flavor without you adding butter to the pan. Just cut back wherever you can, okay? So let's get started. meat for about 10 minutes on high if y'all can smell this it smells so good but we turned our heat down to two and now i'm gonna do three at a time but in that same flavor that the meat was cooking we're just gonna put our tortillas in here and leave them in just for a couple of seconds just so they can get a little color to them Okay, so we finished our meat, our shells, and that's our salsa that's been prepping. Now, the key to this, you don't need any taco shapers. You don't need to put them in the oven or anything like that. Literally, as soon as they come out of the pan, you just have to fold them yourself. And these street taco tortillas are super fragile. So even when I had them in Corpus, like they doubled up the shells. So if that's what you would like to do, please do that but i just folded them up and they'll literally shape themselves see so now i'm just gonna build 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 and y'all will see the end result okay this is the last and final step but this is extra you do not have to do this but i got my little light up cup since it's taco tuesday okay so lime juice on the rim I'm gonna do this over. Okay, on the rim, sugar, no salt. Alright, this is the finished product. I love some plain just because everybody doesn't like um, the toppings and all of that. But they are super fresh, you guys. And we have her. She is good and ready to go with the rim but yes you guys but thank you guys i have to be extra thank you guys so so much for tuning into this video i really appreciate it we're about to eat thank you guys for tuning into this video it is officially taco tuesday okay thank you guys for the support keep subscribing keep sending me videos that you want to see and I'll be sure to give them to you guys this month, okay? Love you guys. Stay safe.